All right, guys, this is part two. So I had to cut the other one off, uh, but uh, I got busy yesterday and it took a lot more. Uh, I had nine stanchions to um, re-glue, so I had to do that last night. But uh, here's part two, and uh, here is Vinny's check-in and check-out shed that he built for me. I love it. Vinny, you've done a great job, bud. I couldn't ask for anything better. And, um, it's awesome. I love it. I will be putting a decal, probably on a piece of plastic card right up here with the Peregrine Intermodal logo that I showed you. And I'll probably put it on the side or on the other side. I hadn't really decided yet. But let me give you guys a walk around view of it so you can see kind of what it looks like here. It's great job, Vinny. Great, great, great job. And also, for another little treat for you guys, <clears throat> let me get around this side first. Kind of looking in there. Trucks entering and trucks departing. But anyway, guys, um, and some other little bit of free time that I had, I um, I went ahead and did like a very rough uh, mock-up on the computer, one of my computer programs that I use for my uh, my Shel Shelford Rail office building and the museum. And Vinny is getting the duty. He is going to build those for me. And he is also, let me walk over here, he's also going to be doing an engine paint shed that's going to go on the right hand side of the diesel facility right over there. And um, if you guys haven't seen it, I'll probably put a link once this gets uploaded to the uh, video this we're going to try and do it pretty close to the prototype that Norfolk Southern has a video painting the uh, veterans unit locomotive, we're probably going to try pretty close to the to that but um anyway I got some trains running I got the sound off so I won't have to be fighting over it but um there's kind of a uh, far away look we can get a look looking from the plastics plant facility down there arriving I can't wait I'll probably go this weekend and get some of the uh the big signs like Vinny said and go ahead and get this ready and uh, hopefully if Santa Claus is good to me, I will, um, I will get, um, a little bit more than half of this table done. I may be able to swing getting all this side of the table done. I haven't, uh, decided yet. Uh, to see. I'm trying to wait and see how many, um, if they come up with some pretty groovy after Christmas specials. But uh, anyway, uh, let me put you on pause. Let me go over to my office. And um, I'll, uh, I'll show you the buildings. I've got one is the home office building you're going to see. And the other one is the Shelford Rail Museum. And I got one like kind of combined so I could kind of get an idea how they're going to look. Because... I love that building, Benny. It is awesome. So, guys, if you need something built, Benny is your man, either in scale or HO. I could not be happier with this thing. I love it. I can't wait to get my decal poster signage up on it. And um, but anyway, just to give you guys an idea, right about there at the end of my finger, that's where the Shelford Rail Office is going to go, and then the Shelford Rail Museum will be over there. They got to keep in mind too; it's going to be elevated a little bit too, as well. And um, the other thing that's going to be right beside this, or maybe just a little bit behind it, in front of the office building, will be a static display of some type of steam engine. I'm not sure yet what kind or anything like that, but we'll have to see. But anyway, hang on, guys. I'll be right back, and you can see I'm going to see the design I'm going to have for my office building and shelf and rail museum. Be right back. All right, guys. That is the Shelford Rail uh, head office. Um, it's in the town, the fictional town that I made up. It's in my novel, Prey. 
and uh, that is office building. I'm um, going to challenge Ovenny with this build. Uh, if you can see the angled stuff right here, so that's going to be interesting. And next, let me show you. This will be the museum. Notice the big tall glass windows. We're going to try and make it to where like a boxcar on static display inside the building so you can see inside of it. But um, we'll have to see. And here's kind of a little mock-up of kind of what they'll look like all together side by side. I think that's pretty cool. I like the design of them. I think Vinny says he can do it, so we're going to find out. <laughs> so I'm going to challenge Mr. Vinny and see. But um, that's that. Let me do it one more time right quick for you. Together. Back. Rail Museum. And the Home Office. So... Hope you like it, guys. I'm pretty excited about it. I like, I like, I like the design. It's pretty modern, and that's that's what this layout is. It's a modern day layout. So, figured we needed something pretty modern looking. So, I hope that's going to fit the bill. But anyway, uh, let me put you on pause and get back in the train room. I got one more surprise for you guys. So, hang on just one second. All right, guys. I'm back. I'm just going to focus in on the uh, the intermodal check in and check out facility while I do this. Um, I'd been planning to do this once I got my hundredth subscriber to the YouTube and I still can't I mean I just can't even imagine having this many um, subscribers I've, I'm up to 123 and uh, I never would have thought that in a million years but um, I just want to say thank you guys for subscribing to my channel um, I'm pretty new to the hobby but I think I'm learning pretty quick but uh, anyway I'm gonna run a this is gonna be the 100 the 100th subscriber contest but it'll be the 123 uh, member subscriber contest. Um, I've been putting it off. I was going to wait till I was going to do it right before I knew Vinny had already mailed this thing, and then we had another setback with the thing being broke. But anyway, um, I'm going to do the drawing before Christmas. Uh, I'll film my little one, Grafton, who uh, got all this started. <laughs> um, I'm going to let him pick the winner, and uh, the winner will be. I'm sorry, what you will win is um, either a, a gift of $25 in a, the anything to deal with model trains or I will design you some logos for you. And uh, depending on your complexity of the design, you know, I'm trying to equate it to what I charge to do graphics on the side. But I figure like either two or three custom signs and, you know, I can do you two or three sheets of, of decals on that. But um, it would be your choice. Um, if, if, if you decide for an op for something, you know, to go and you lay out a car or something, just let me know and uh, we'll get together once uh, the winner's been chosen. But um, anyway, and to enter, all you have to do is tell me your favorite kind of locomotive. It can be steam, it can be diesel, and uh, for those who, who watch my channel pretty regularly, I think you probably know my favorite type of locomotive. <laughs> But if not, if you're new to my channel, you haven't really got a chance to look at all my other videos, um, it is the EMD SD40-2. And um, I like them so much that um, you can probably see some of them scattered about in here. I, and, uh, I have three others that's out being painted right now. I've got uh, two more BLI Paragon 2s that's going to be painted. And if you're not knowing, those two and the other two are being painted in the orange and white Illinois Central Gulf scheme and they'll be numbered 6 6030 through 6033 that was the last four ICG engines ever ordered through EMD and uh, it's kind of like sentimental to me so but anyway just tell me your favorite locomotive in the comment section I'll uh, tally them all up uh, let's see that'll be Monday um, and then on Christmas Eve, I will make a video and announce the winner and upload it. I'll have Grafton um, pick it out of a hat, and then uh, you can just contact me. But it's just I just want to say thank you guys for subscribing and uh, doing all your comments and tips and stuff from all your other videos because this helped me a lot. And uh, one quick another shout out to Vinny. Vinny, I love the building. It is awesome, man. Um, I can't wait to get the office building and the museum building in. But, uh, and thank you all the subscribers. I really appreciate it. And, uh, any comments on Vinny's structure, if you need a structure, you know, hey, get Vinny, get in touch with Vinny. 
It's a BNSF 60. Oh gosh, Vinny, I'm going to mess this up. 6951, I think. But I'm sure you'll comment if I said that wrong, Vinny. I'm sorry. But uh, anyway, um, uh, I'll go ahead and wish some guys an early Christmas because I'm sure some will want to see who the winner is. Hopefully, and I'll do a, a proper uh, Merry Christmas uh, wish to everybody out there, my subscribers. But um, I guess that's about it. I'll leave you with a, another quick shot of Vinny's building. They did it for me. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. But, um, anyway, you guys have a good weekend. Uh, try not to get out too much and have to fight the crowds. Hope everybody got their Christmas shopping done. And, uh, everything, everybody's ready for Christmas. But, um, anyway, I will talk to you guys later. Comments, likes, new subscribers are always welcome. And, as always, thanks for watching, guys. Later.